Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. Today's video is super exciting and brought to you by Horsewheel TV. The reason we can bring you these high production uh, videos, connecting you to top riders, seeing the most amazing stables all around the world is because of our platform. So if you like the content you see here today, uh, do go and check us out on Horsewheel TV. We have got a wide range of videos, uh, a big range of different topics you can learn. Uh, there's a lot of different fun adventures we're going on as well, all to do with horses. So if what you see today uh, is interesting, do head over there. But for now, let's get into the video. Welcome back, everyone. I cannot believe at which stable I am. As an Australian rider and as a lover of horses and the sport in general, we are at Edwina Tops Alexander Stable and it looks unreal. I already got a little bit of a glimpse of a few things from driving in but it looks insane. Edwin is waiting around the corner, so let's go meet her and she can show us around. Hello, nice to see you. <laughs> nice to see you too. What an amazing place. <laughs> I'm already lost because it's so big, but I drove in and I saw a little bit of Tops International and then I saw a little bit of the stables and I'm just dying to see everything. It looks insane. Well, yeah. come on in. You I'm are very welcome. excited. Thank you very much for coming. And not even the weather can ruin this for me. So <laughs> I'm, uh, I'm seeing already a lot of beautiful, beautiful different buildings, which I'm sure we'll be finding out a little bit more. Um, but how long have you been here now at this place? Um, I've been here 18 years. Okay. Yeah. Um, the main barn was built 20 years ago. Okay. Um, you wouldn't say so. It looks brand new. Yeah. Well, <laughs> we try to look after it. Yeah, no, you, you absolutely do. So this is Top Gun. This was Jan's best horse. Okay. And he won the gold medal in Barcelona on. So Amazing. He gets a statue. He gets his little homage. Yes, he's got his special place here. Wow. And as you can see down there is the show. That's Tops International Arena. Wow. And we've got a walker over here. Is it strange for you to, to just be like in your stable and then you look over and it's just a huge competition venue right there? Is that strange for you or is um, it just normal now? Well, now it's becoming more normal, but it, okay. it, it is strange actually when the show is going on. Yeah. Because then you're kind of yeah, like, yeah. hang on a minute, I'm back here, I'm all relaxed, everything's quiet. And then all of a sudden there's so much action going on over there. Yeah, you're brushing your horse and then you can hear the crowd. Yeah. Nice, eh? <laughs> yeah. Okay, amazing. Okay, let's go. Wow. So here we are in the main barn. So beautiful. And you can see all the feeds have been put out for tomorrow morning. Yeah. The horses actually get the hay first and then okay. they get the hard feeds. It's much better okay. for their digestion. Um, so this is the area from Qatar. So they have all their horses here that we train. And also we have a rider called Mike Kawai who is from Japan and he has his horses there as well. Okay. So this barn we are um, uh, managing and sort of overlooking everything. Okay, perfect. And then we can walk down here. This is just a- Sorry, yeah. I love this little nook. How cool is that? <laughs> you just have like a little seating area. I would just yeah. sit here and just take it all in. Just like <laughs> watch everything. Coffee. And you yeah. can see in the stained glass windows, that's the logo of Cell Tops. In there. Yeah, it's so beautiful. And I don't think people realize just how tall yeah. the like ceiling is. And Very here high. it's opened up. Is that a bell? Yeah. Oh, does it- to wake you up in the morning. <laughs> do, they, do you actually ring that or? <laughs> oh. <laughs> So this um, barn is the young horses from Style Tops. Okay. And, um, a lot of horses that we've bred. Wow. As you can see they're all, they've been fed, they're all happy. They all look immaculate, I have to oh, say. Really? Okay, that's they nice. Look the girls will be happy. Beautiful, yeah, yeah. yeah. They look insane. Wow. And even all the detailing at the top of all yeah. the windows. Yeah. I love the details. And we can open that up when it gets um, a little bit too hot. And there you have the heating up the top there. Yeah. So, oh yeah, there are yeah. the vents for the heating. Yeah. And something you actually don't really see often in stable is that this is full of like rounded edges. Like everything is yeah. round. Uh -huh. There's not really too many like straight lines. Yeah. And I quite like that. Yeah, it's much softer. Yeah. yeah. And in a way also homier. Yes. It's yeah. more inviting, but exactly. still super high class. Yeah. yeah. Well, yeah, the idea um, Jan had, he wanted it to be like a home environmental, um, also like horse first, as I've said before, but um, also to keep it really, a really nice warm environment. Yeah, you know, absolutely. Happy warm environment and safe. Yeah. <laughs> okay, so here we are um, in the area where we have the clinic, the vet clinic and the water treadmill. Yeah, we, I saw. Yeah, so we use this um, quite a lot. 
not all the horses like it, but most of them like it. So um, I like that this one is like at ground level. Like it's yeah. not, there's no incline or anything. Yeah. It's just at the same level as the ground. That exactly. must make it easier for them to get yeah. on the roll. Yeah, and you can adjust the water level. Yeah. Um, and okay, there's a filter perfect. through it. And so you can, you know, keep the water clean and wow. you can um, reuse the water again. Amazing. So environmental friendly. And then we have in here... Um, well, here's a scale to weigh the horse. Yeah, name. I was just saying to Adrina, <laughs> this is so perfect because it's yeah. so hard to tell if your horse has gained or lost weight, but having a scale is pretty handy. Yeah, very handy. And this is the vet clinic in here. We have two full-time vets and they have fantastic facilities. Um, we have a scanner, um, x-ray machine, shock waving, everything you kind of need. That's perfect. So yeah. if anything ever happens, you have somebody on hand that yeah. can take care of it. Yeah. That's so good. Yeah. If only everybody could have that. <laughs> that I know, would be very helpful. We're very privileged. Yeah, very privileged. Yeah. So, um, yeah, and it's really nice to work in here and it's always clean. And, yeah, you know. but it's also nice to have an active team you work with. So when you have to purchase a horse or if you have any questions, you know, they're reliable and, sure. you know, yeah. you can trust them. Yeah. Wow, exactly. very good. So, yeah, so we're Room for everything happy to here. have this. Yeah, absolutely. I'm going to take you into my barn. Okay, <laughs> finally. Yeah. <laughs> okay, so this is my tack room that I'll show you. With Wow. Sort of everything and anything in here. <laughs> I love that it's like, it's beautiful, but it's definitely like a working tack room. Yeah, like I can feel practical. like the sport inside yeah. here as well. All the bridles there. Wow, um, beautiful. And boots. I like the stone also on the ground. Yeah, that's a bit following the rest of the theme of it. The yeah, sense. exactly. No, all my saddles, nice. they've all got their own saddle. Nice, very Amarigo nice. Amerigo saddles, so they've all got their own, all made to measure to fit them. Beautiful. And um, then I have in here a lot of storage. Do you want to see? Let's see. <laughs> let's, let's test it. We know on really how, how, uh, how tidy organized. everything is. Exactly. <laughs> this is a surprise, right? I'm not. Oh, okay. Oh, it's good. Okay, not so bad. Like lots, lots of bridles. Lots of bridles. Yeah. All sorts of bridles. You have enough for the whole stable here? <laughs> yes, I do. I have to be careful they don't go missing though. Yeah. All my breastplates. And then um, in here, I think I have all the girths. Oh my God, it's super tidy. Yeah. Wow, here we go. Reese will be very happy you said that. Wow. All the girths, all my helmets up there. Amazing. Spurs, everything's here. But wait, what helmet do you ride in? A Charles Owen? Yeah. Or, okay, yeah, because yeah, yeah. I, I always saw that staple like velvet helmet you yeah. wore. I think this it's super the most nice. Comfortable one. Yeah. yeah. And, and it's, it's kind of Aussie safe. in a way. Yeah. Like yeah. in Australia, like a lot of the, a few show jumpers and a lot of showies wear it yeah. as well. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I like it. Been wearing it for years. So very comfortable hat. Um, Alberto's is here. Wow, also very nice. So, yeah. And he's got he's a few got trophies of, of his own. Yes, he's got a, just a couple, <laughs> only a couple. <laughs> um, bridles and also just lots of storage there. Should we test them and see how tidy he is? Oh my gosh, I don't know. Let's have a look. <laughs> this could be dirty. Well, this looks tidy-ish. Okay, it's not very bad. Good. Okay, this is getting. Okay, so not I'm as seeing good. some Italian stuff going some on. <laughs> food down there. Yeah. Um, I don't know what's in here. Oh, okay, not bad. Hopefully no nasty surprises. Okay. It's just folded, <laughs> exactly. It's all folded It's up. very good. I so, really love these windows. They kind of yeah. uh, set out a little bit everywhere with the logo, but yeah. I like that idea a lot. It's nice. It's very nice. Yeah. You don't see that often. No. And what is this? Um, so this is um, a um, management board. So okay. it's like, tell gives a list of all the horses and the program okay. and like an electric an, whiteboard yeah it's like a no it's like an uh, we have an app and okay all the horses are down there and um the program of what they've got to do so wow um the the riders can follow and um the grooms and see how many times they've got a hand walk or go mm -hmm. on the walker or the treadmill or whatever their program might be okay and that's the Amazing. board they come in first thing and they have a look at it and um unfortunately it's not working at the moment Oh. Otherwise, I could, <laughs> I could explain it to you, but we've had some Next issues time. with the Wi-Fi there. So okay. we're busy getting that fixed, but we've got it all on the app. So yeah, okay. it works quite good. Wow, yeah. incredible. Yeah, very nice. very handy and you feel very organized once you've done the list every day. It does take me about an hour to do, but oh, wow. I do get it done. And now we're in your office. Now we're in my, yeah, now wow. we're in my office, yeah. It's so incredible. I'm very it's lucky. so beautiful as well. Thank you. Yeah. And I have to say like, I don't know if you, people can gauge size-wise, but the boxes are huge. Like the stables are yeah. so spacious. Everything in here is very spacious. Yeah, no, they're very and lucky horses. Is it all rubber? Yeah, it's like a wow. liquid kind of a rubber. So it doesn't Amazing. Slip. 
And then, um, yeah, it's really peaceful in here. If and you have to show us one horse, not your favorite, we would never say that about our fur children. But yes. if we have to go to one of your uh, best horses, which way would we go? Oy. Oh, gosh. We better not speak too loud. They might not like me. <laughs> <laughs> um, well, I'm probably going to have to say... Difficult, isn't it? Yeah, it is hard. I'll probably have to say California. Okay. She's over here. Do you want to see her? Yeah, maybe yeah. we go say hi. Okay. She's very sweet. Hello. She is... Um, come here, sweetheart. She's just really sure of herself. And um, you can see she's you know, thinking a lot about what's going on, but um, very, very sweet and big heart. Um, she just gives maximum. Um, and I can feel when she's having a good day or when she's not. She generally, the first day of the show is generally not the best day of the show. Um, so I just try to forget about that day. <laughs> but um, she's always been like that. And then as the show goes, she gets much better and more settled and more relaxed. And um, she's just, she just, she just does whatever I ask her to do, but she's quite, um, you know, quirky and she can be a little spooky around the place. Um, but I think that's a good thing that, Hi. that keeps them sharp and yeah, she's really sweet. Um, she's very sweet. Yeah. She's got also a very sweet eye. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. So, um, and she's a great size for me. So she's not too big, not too small, but. Yeah, because you have some big size. horses as well. Yeah, I have a few <laughs> big ones. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. But um, yeah, she's adorable. So very lucky to have her. Hmm. And then, Right through here is... It's the indoor, yeah. So this is where you train with your horses when you're here? Yeah. Okay, yeah. perfect. So we'll the, have to have winter a look. Time, sometimes in the summer, depending on a little bit the weather. Um, if it's really hot, I can go in here. And out of preference, you like training indoor or outdoor better? Like what's um, your... Outdoor. Outdoor, yeah, okay. Yeah, much prefer outdoor. But when it's cold, <gasps> wow. like it's inside. <laughs> How so beautiful this is, is this? Um, yeah. So and this it's so is... light because you've got that whole side yeah, of... Yeah. Uh, Plenty of light in here. And, and what's up there? Well, that's a judge's box. Oh, nice. So if you ever want to judge wow. my dressage, you can come here. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I'll be up there. Exactly. Yeah. <laughs> so, okay, um, perfect. Is there any way we can turn these lights on? They look amazing. Yeah, that's a good question. Um, I can try over there. I always yeah. make people turn lights on. I'm like, <laughs> show me the light. <laughs> I don't know. Let me try over here. Okay. So we've got this sprinkler system that runs all the way around. Oh, okay. Oh, that's why there's those yeah, openings. That's why there's holes in the side. Uh huh. And then you can see the logo again. Yeah, I like how the logo's kind of uh, a little bit everywhere, even on the glass. Yeah. Uh, there, it looks nice. Let's see. I don't know because it. I know one opens the door. Oh. Oh, that's see? it. <laughs> <laughs> oh, the whole lights. And now. I don't. I like can... the automatic doors that open. That's so cool. Yeah, if they work. This one's stuck. Oh, well, we'll fix that tomorrow. <laughs> I can't turn them on, Matt. Sorry. Oh, that's okay. I'll have to I'll, learn that. I'll appreciate next time. I've only been here 18 years, but I'll <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> see if I can figure that one out. So, yeah, so um, we ride a lot in here during the, obviously, in the wintertime. Yeah. Um, and, and the heating helps because... Yeah. Do you get a lot of snow in this part of the Netherlands? Not or? often. Not okay. Often. Yeah, also like, where I live, we don't yeah, get a lot of yeah. snow. Yeah, we keep it always on 14 degrees, the temperature here. And, um, and, but it's, yeah, perfect temperature. And it's so well insulated that um, when, we're, when it's really hot, you can come in here, it's really nice and cool. Yeah. yeah. Do you find yourself riding a lot with music or do you prefer to be in the zone and nothing um, on? Depends which horse I'm on. <laughs> okay, yeah, <laughs> that's that's a good point. But we have it. No, it's nice to have it on. Just some background music to have it yeah. on, just to keep you, you know, I don't know, to keep a bit of an atmosphere. But outside, obviously not. But um, sometimes the neighbors have some on. But it's <laughs> yeah, <laughs> that's not depends. at your discretion then. <laughs> yeah. So I'll take you over to the other indoor. Yeah. Which is a different size, um, and it, this one has been here for five years now. Okay. Um, it's so beautiful. I wish. Oh, well. We will do our best so everyone can see the details, but it's so pretty how the layout and how it flows also, like it's a really big place, but it doesn't feel so big that it's inconvenient. Correct, yeah. Everything is uh, close by and kind of homey as well. <laughs> yeah. Wow. So, now this is, this is a big arena. <laughs> this <laughs> this is one big. is big, yeah. This one is, um, yeah, like I said, newer, um, but the same style and um, really nice high ceilings and I tend to ride a lot more in the other one yeah just because um, I just 
I don't know, I like it there better. But, yeah. Um, this one's much easier to jump in. Um, but I try to make it difficult as possible for myself. To try. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> so I've got no excuse when I get to the show. Yeah, uh, exactly. Yeah, so, um, so it's different. So we can have, sometimes you can do like maybe an exercise in here and a course in there yep. or you, yep. know, you can switch around a little bit or if there's and just you, too many yeah. people or horses that are a bit shy, you can, you know, sometimes, um, you know, we lunge them in here or there's too much lunging going on. So we ride over there in the other yeah. one. So it just depends a little bit, but no, there's plenty sense. of spaces to ride. And the surface yeah. is like a competition service. This is like what yes. you see out at competitions. Yeah, competition service. So we, we do the ground every day and, um, and we try to keep it really wet and moist and we get it checked regularly and we also get it leveled regularly. Yeah. yeah. I'm getting a lot of inspo. <laughs> Good. <laughs> yeah. No, really nice. All right. I'm going to show you the outdoor now. Okay. Perfect. Okay. There's more. Yeah. <laughs> when you think it couldn't get bigger, <laughs> it does. <laughs> wow. It's amazing. So, it's really beautiful. Yeah. Here we ride pretty much every day, but like there's so many other places to ride. So we're really lucky to be able to be on this big ring as well. And, um, and I think it's about, a hundred by 60 maybe big <laughs> very big big enough to have lots of riders here. yeah absolutely so, but this is great because if you've got just like a tops international it's a big arena so sometimes you have to yeah. practice in big spaces yeah uh and this is excellent for that yeah. do you ever find yourself training at the actual venue at all sometimes or? Yeah. yeah yeah sometimes we put jumps up and we make a course and yeah um, yeah sometimes we do yeah and also just to ride in different places is also yeah nice. exactly yeah. but also i think for a lot of people getting your horse that chill that experience of being at a big venue is yeah. difficult but for you it's on your doorstep yeah. so that's quite easy then that helps out very lucky yeah, yeah very lucky so here's the feed room wow big <laughs> yeah big industrial size yeah <laughs> and lots of different sort of horse feed here I use Red Mill, so they sponsor me. So all my horses have Red Mills. Amazing. And Very good. Some of the other horses or people here use different things, but um, we use Red Mills. Okay. And, um, and you've got all your supplements, everything yeah, going on list, here. Yeah, everything going on there. And um, yeah, so it's quite clean and yeah, tidy. Yeah, it's and, beautiful. Yeah. And it also smells like, how would you describe the smell? Vitamins yeah. and like, I don't know, it just smells, it smells good, healthy. Huh? Yeah. I don't Are know you hungry? Saying. Yes, <laughs> always hungry. <laughs> so here are the fields. Nice. Um, we've got two sand fields um, that um, this is sort of being newly drainaged because in the winter time you get a lot of problems. And yeah. A lot of water and then you can't really put them out and it's a bit muddy and messy and they're not really happy to go out. So yeah, absolutely. And you have your water cannons as well. So you keep yeah. everything so nice and green. They've all got, yeah, no excuse for water and um, yeah, not all of them go out. I think um, it depends a little bit on the horses and the program of the horses and, um, and uh, you know, what's the best for the horses. But we try to put most of them out just maybe an hour every day if possible. And, but we always have someone here all the time in case something happens. Oh, monitoring. Yeah, yeah. all the time because it's too, much, too risky. And yeah, they're, that makes they're sort sense. of big enough to run around, but not that big. But they're enough that they can enjoy it as well. And, yeah. Um, and if the ones that have, you know, been on an injury, you can put them on the sand so they're not eating too much. And but so we try to space it out and monitor a bit and just, um, you know, make sure the horses are happy. I hope we get to come back and uh, and keep showing a few more things because there's a lot more to show. <laughs> there's a lot more to see, especially with what's going on all the way down there. <laughs> um, but yeah, thank you so much for the tour. Thank you guys for watching, and we'll catch you on the next one. Bye bye. <laughs> bye.